The Fall Guys survival update is finally here. We finally have survival in creative mode. See, if you go to build a level, you have race or survival. And there's a new show that we're gonna be playing called Survival Showdown with a playlist of new survival levels. And there's a lot of other stuff that was added too. They apparently added a volcano theme, which I've literally predicted. If you check my Twitter page, I literally predicted a volcano theme being added. And there's also a bunch of new power-ups too. This is just a huge update. So without further ado, let's jump into the Survival Showdown show and check out all the new levels okay this first level is called back and forth and this one's by the fall guys team whoa okay yeah they added hex tiles to creative mode too i forgot about that oh wait why are the hex tiles not disappearing oh there we go they're shaking that was interesting that was really weird actually okay so we have to walk backwards so i'm pretty sure we don't want to touch that slime right that's that slime is definitely going to kill us so don't don't touch the slime okay what is the goal? Oh, I just have to survive, right? So there's no finish line. Okay, I was kind of thinking that this was gonna be kind of like slime climb, where there would be a finish line, but no. You just have to survive, so okay. The boxes are gonna try to push you into the slime spikes. Oh no. And then the conveyor belt changes direction. Okay, this is kind of cool. I wonder what the players are gonna make. I can't wait to play some of your survival levels, so please join my Discord with the link in the description and submit any survival levels that you build because I'm gonna be making plenty of videos playing your survival levels. Okay, I'm just gonna try to stay in the center here. Bro, this is crazy. Okay, seven people have died so far. It's a little bit more need to die and then we'll be good. Oh no, my screen just froze for a second. Okay, this lobby actually does look kind of sweaty. All right, there we go. We made it. Let's go. First level was pretty easy. Let's see what comes next. I assume they're going to get harder. Whoa. I can like or dislike levels. Oh, I missed my chance. But if you look at the right side of the screen, there was a like or dislike button. What is this, YouTube? Click the like button, guys. <laughs> Click the like button for more survival content. Bean Fort. Okay, so we have two levels with the name Fort in them. Ooh, this is kind of cool, actually. This is a really well-designed level. All right, so... Oh, this is one of the new power-ups. Wait. Ooh. Okay, so you can go invisible. Kind of like in Sweet Thieves, that level, Sweet Thieves. You can go invisible in these levels now. But what's the purpose of that? Why am why am I going invisible? Oh my, why is my game freezing? Okay, three people are dead so far. Just one more person needs to die. Oh, so there's like, what is this? Is that a rhino? What? Uh, I can throw tiny rhinos at people? Bro, what is going on? There's so much, this might be the biggest update we've had in a long time. Like this is a huge update. I'm gonna like the level. Uh, I don't even know how, okay. Ooh, okay, we made it to the final. This level is called Bouncy Castle. Bro, look how new I am to this. There's only 700 plays on these levels so far. Oh my, yo, wait, this is really cool. I think the hex tiles are broken. Okay, I'm not gonna fully blame Mediatonic for this because the update is still very new. So there's probably a lot of things that need to be fixed, like glitches and stuff. But I don't think the hex tiles are working pro- Oh wait, no, those ones are disappearing. Maybe you can change, like, maybe you can edit how fast hex tiles disappear when you're building levels. Maybe that's what it is. Why is my game freezing? Oh my god, I need to fix that. I, I think I might be playing on like, I don't know, my game just freezes for some reason right now. Okay, so only one person has died so far. What? Oh, there's a huge bar. I didn't even see that. Oh my god, okay. Where did that come from? Was that always there? All right, so I can stay in the middle or I can go in the hex tiles. I think I'm gonna go in the hex tiles. That bar is scary. I Look how massive that top bar is. This is an SS2 level. It's got the space background. Oh my, dude. Wait, this is actually, this is genuinely cool. I was not expecting this. This update is huge, bro. Look, you got little rocket ships planets on the sky like on the outsides of the map i don't know what the purpose of these like boom <gasps> no bro why is my game freezing i literally just froze my way to death okay here we go we're back in i think i fixed the freezing this level is called slime surfers all right let's check this out how many levels were added to this show i'm curious also the goal of this video is i want to just try to get three wins i think that's doable we can do that right i want to just try to get three wins wait this is kind of cool we're on a hoverboard I mean, basically, it's basically a hoverboard. They made like their own hoverboard with these little boxes. That's really cool. Okay, this is extremely similar to Hoverboard Heroes, actually. Wait, is this wall gonna open? Oh, there we go. Okay, so you basically, oh no, they're splitting apart. The boxes are like slightly splitting apart. Okay, so you have to watch out. Don't get caught on the walls or anything. 
Oh, what are these? <gasps> I, I literally jumped and the, the hoverboard just slid right under me. Okay, so you gotta be careful with jumping. I was not expecting that. All right, we got Bean Fort again. I think I've had this already. Okay, yeah, here we go. So let me actually fully check out this level though because I didn't even really understand it the first time I played. All I know is you can go invisible and there's some kind of tiny rhinos too. Wait, let me find the rhinos because I've already tried the invisible power up. Okay, yeah, so you can basically, they're basically boom blasters, right? Isn't that basically, oh. Oh, okay, they don't explode until they touch a player, I think. Wait, let me see. Yeah, so, okay, so they kind of, like, once you deploy them, the rhino just walks around, but they're not actually going to explode unless they make contact with another player. That's really cool. Okay, let me... Nope, okay. <laughs> let me drop one here. All right, nice, I got that guy. Dude, this is really cool. I've said that, like, five times now, but, like, I was not expecting this many things to be added. Like, I knew we were getting survival mode, but there's so much other stuff added, too, like the invisible power-up, the rhino, the hex tiles, and, like, these Fall Guys team rounds are pretty cool, but I'm really excited to play your levels. I'm gonna be checking the Discord for any submissions that I get, because, dude, I'm gonna play a bunch of your levels. And now there's more variety. So whenever I play creative levels, I can like switch between race and survival levels and just adds more variety to creative, which is really good. Okay, let's see if we can win this game. If we get one win here, we'll just need two more. Again, the goal of this video is to get three wins in total. Slime Surfers, again, okay. Let me see if I can actually qualify here. I messed up so badly the last time I played this. Okay, here we go. This seriously does remind me of Hoverboard Heroes though. This is like, uh, mom, can we have Hoverboard Heroes? No, we have Hoverboard Heroes at home. This is literally what this level is. Okay, wait, how does this wall collapse? Does it just do it by itself or is there a button we have to push? Okay, it just does it by itself, okay. All right, I'm gonna stay in the middle. And again, I have to be very careful with jumping. I feel like you only want to jump if you're close to the front or the middle. Because if you jump, the hoverboard can just slide right under you. Okay, there's the punching gloves. So you can actually punch people. Oh my, that's so overpowered. I just saw someone go flying. I need to try that. I didn't get a chance to actually grab one of them myself, but I need to try that. Bouncy castle again. Okay, let's see if I can actually get a win this time. Because last time I died in the cheapest way possible. My game just froze on me. But I, I think all that is fixed. So I should be able to get the win. All right, so from what I've learned, I think these hex tiles at the top, they're supposed to not disappear automatically. I thought that it was a glitch, but no, I think they just, Fall Guys edited them so they would disappear slower. That must be like an option in creative to make the hex tiles disappear slower. So that's kind of interesting because we've never seen anything like that with the hex tiles in Unity levels. Also, I see why I never noticed the big- <gasps> What? Oh! What just happened? Bro, the- <laughs> I touched a blast ball and it just rolled me forward. I was not expecting it. I was just trying to land on the hex tile. I, I, anyway, like I was saying, I, I know why I didn't notice the top bar at the start because it, it doesn't move immediately. It's like static and then moves later. All right, I'm just going to cut to when we make it back to the final because I want to, I really want to get a win, bro. I want to, I want to get a win so badly. I still have not even gotten one win yet. Okay, I made it back to the final and this is a different one. We got something called Cosmic Clash. So there's multiple finals. I wonder how many there are. I've gotten two so far. Are there any more than that? All right, here we go. I got to lock in because I really want to start getting wins. Oh, there's a big picture of a rhino over there. Wait, that's actually really cool. This kind of reminds me of pixel painters a little bit, although it's a survival level. So what is the objective here? I'm a little confused on that. Is it just, okay, I can get, I can get the invisibility power up. Let me just do that. If I'm invisible, they can't see me. Nobody could do anything. That guy going to see me. Oh, he knows I'm here. I'm gonna sneak somewhere and I'm just gonna go invisible. Oh, the invisibility runs out. I forgot about that. I thought I could just endlessly go invisible and live forever. That was stupid. How do you actually kill people though? Like I'm not exactly, wait, two people are already dead. I could probably get the win right here. This map is a little bit too big, I feel like. Like this map is really, oh no. <gasps> I was literally about to say it's too hard to kill people. And then right as I was about to say that, I die. Of course, he has the golden banner too. This guy's a sweat. Look, I'm just figuring everything out, okay? I've never played these maps before. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, I made it back to the final again. And we got Bouncy Castle. Come on. I just need, I just want to start getting wins. The goal of this video is to get three wins. I haven't even gotten one yet. All right, the good thing is I've already played this level before, so I have experience on it. So I already sort of know what to do. I just mainly need to watch out for that big bar at the top. I'm gonna stay on the hex tiles. Actually, you know what might be smart? What if I just go on the lily pads and just make dives? So that way I'm always like, you know what I mean? I'm always low. 
Oh no, the, the bar can still hit me. Okay, that's that's a bad idea. I was thinking maybe I could avoid the bar that way, but I don't think that's gonna work. Dude, this is so strange. Okay, gonna make slow dives. Hopefully we can get the win. I don't think the bar can reach me when I'm over here, can it? No, it can't. All right, so as long as I stay over here, I'm good. Three people are dead. Ooh, I might get the win. It's just a 1v1 now. Please, bro. I need to start getting the wins. Come on. Yes! I saw him fall. Let's go, dude. First win of the day. I'm gonna drop a like on that level too. Let's go, dude. Finally. All right, one win down, two more to go. All right, I made it back to the final again and we got Cosmic Clash. Let's see if we can get our second win right here. Last time I played this, I messed up pretty bad. So let's see if I can win this time. I think I have a pretty good understanding of what to do. It's a re- What are these guys doing? Okay. It's a really big map, so you pretty much just... What if I just stay over here? This seems like a safe spot. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm literally just gonna chill in this corner and not do anything. I might actually be able to win the game that way. Ooh, the hex tiles disappeared. Oh, I was not expecting that. Okay, this side is probably not as safe anymore. I'm still gonna stay over here though, because there's no one anywhere near me. Oh no, the chicken sees me. Oh, the chicken sees me. Oh, he's coming after me. Oh no, no, chicken, go away. Go away, chicken. No one likes you. All right, come on. Just gonna keep running. That's all I gotta do. Just keep running. Okay, now I'm on this corner. Is there anyone still following me? I don't think so. Wait, the chicken. Does the chicken see me? Oh no, the chicken's going after the other guy. Okay, that's good. Oh, they both fell. Let's go. I got the win. Okay, that was really easy, actually. Two wins down, one more to go. All right, I made it back to the final again and we got Bouncy Castle. Let's see if we can get our third win right here. Okay, I think I've gotten pretty good at this map. So I'm just gonna go straight down to the- Okay, that guy is down with the hex tiles with me. All right, let me find a different island. I'm gonna go on this one. What am I even supposed to do with these blast balls? Like, I don't know how I would throw them at other people, you know? Because everyone else is so far away. I guess it's just if someone comes close to you. All right, one person is dead so far. Bro, I'm not gonna lie though. I really like this update so far. Like, I know I've said that that already but oh no there's someone with me okay i'm down like obviously the stuff that i'm showing in this video is pretty basic like it's the basics of the update you know i'm basically just playing the levels that mediatonic made with survival mode but once we start playing the levels made by the players we're gonna see some pretty crazy stuff and even these levels are pretty good like i'm not gonna lie these levels in this show are a lot better than the fall guys team rounds that we got during the race levels like remember that one level blueberry bombardment or whatever it was called like we've come a long way since that one creative is definitely improving for sure like you got rocket ships in the background planets this level actually looks really cool so the potential is crazy and i like i said i wasn't expecting all these power-ups to be added there we go let's go i got the win three wins we completed our goal. And before we end this video, I just wanted to show you guys the volcano theme that they added too. So this is what the volcano theme looks like. Pretty cool. You can see all the volcanoes in the background. This is one of the coolest things about the update in my opinion, because it's been a while since we've gotten a brand new theme. It's been close to a year, I think. And I predicted this. I predicted that they would add a volcano theme to Fall Guys. It looks even cooler if you use the volcano theme in a race level, because look at this. In a race level, there's a giant volcano right in the middle. When you build it in survival, it's kind of covered up by all the slime. But here, so you have this massive massive volcano but anyway please send me your levels join my discord the link is at the top of the description send me any survival levels that you make or race levels but preferably survival levels right now since it's new i'm gonna be making so much content on this new survival update so send me your levels i'll play them in videos and thanks for watching subscribe